Hello, sports fans, sports bettors, and YouTube world. John here with Vicket Picks. Uh, if you're new to my channel, welcome to daily sports betting advice. Uh, free. The only thing I'll ever ask you guys to smash that thumbs up button. Uh, if you're new, make sure to hit that subscribe button if you want to uh, subscribe to my channel. Love you. Love to have you on board. Hit the little bell for notifications, and you'll get, you know, a little bing or whatever it is when I make a new video. So, uh, make uh, cover multiple sports. Make multiple videos a day uh, big into baseball hockey and football uh, recently got into hockey so uh, we're having fun with that it's it's been fun um, I always like learning new stuff learn every day that's what, uh, that's what my motto of life is just learn anything goes wrong you can just learn from it so carry on but I've had another free play winner today uh, two and one with our chart picks just a great winning hockey day I, I, lo I love winning it makes me feel good I hate losing uh, most people do, but uh, yeah, just try to get uh, try to get the best information I can for you guys. We had uh, our chart picks. We had Sharks winner, Jets winner, Bruins were technically a chart pick, and the chart only depicts win probabilities. They do not predict three ways and all that stuff. I said take them on the three ways, so it lost. That was my bad again. Uh, just a lot of a lot of juice to lay if you take them on a the straight money line. And I thought they'd cover it, but it took them to overtime. So we counted it as a loss, and we carry on. We had Dallas and the Blues under one and a half goals in the first period. That hit. Uh, Bishop uh, for Dallas is the man on these unders. So, you know, we kind of got that in our little memory bank. But now we're moving on to Sun Saturday, November 30th. Uh, it's already here. It's uh, shortly after midnight. Got to get up early and drive about four, four and a half hours. So not looking forward to that, but it is what it is. Uh, getting the NHL free play for you right now. We got the Washington Capitals at the Detroit Red Wings. Uh, Detroit enters this contest seven, eighteen, and three on the season. They're just having a bad year, averaging twenty-eight point nine six shots per game and scoring two point nine one goals per game. Detroit is four, eight, and one at home this season. Uh, the Red Wings are led by Anthony Monta and Tyler Bertuzzi on offense, but they will be without Monta as he has been injured. Um, I am seeing that Calvin Picard is prob the probable goalie for the Red Wings. Uh, the only information I have on Picard is he's 0-1 this season with a 6.03 goals against average and 82.9% save percentage. So, uh, yeah, he had a rough go over his first game, it looks like. The Capitals come in 18-4-5 on the season, 10-2-1 on the road, averaging 31.35 shots and 3.65 goals per game. Capitals are led in offense by John Carlson and Alex Ovechkin. Looks like Ilya Samsonov will get the call in net for the Caps. Uh, Samsonov is 5-2-1 on the season with a 2.65 goals against average. Your official Ricketts paw pick, ice cold paw pick of the day, is the Washington Capitals on the puck line minus 1.5, which means they have to win by two for a one-unit play. Um, I would also personally... Lean on the Caps scoring four goals or more in this game. Uh, if anybody's interested in looking at that, I'm not going to release a, an official play on it, but it is a a strong lean that I would suggest you look into if you are into that kind of stuff. But uh, I'd like to thank you guys now for uh, watching this video. If you're new, hit the little subscribe button. Hit the bell for notifications. It'll let you know when I pop out a new video. Um, for everybody that's uh, um, looking forward to my chart picks every day, I will apologize right now in advance. I will be on the road and traveling tomorrow a lot. Uh, i got to drive four and a half hours down, do some stuff, and then drive four and a half hours back. So I will not have any time to go over and get all my information and have chart picks. So I do apologize in advance, but there will be no chart picks for tomorrow. So just so you're you're aware. And uh, if you guys leave me any messages or anything up there, I won't get them until I get back. But uh just uh, just to be straight up and forward with that. But, uh, guys, have a wonderful day. And the most important thing, good luck with your bets.